introduction and implementation of dictionaries in python dictionaries in python dictionary is an unordered collection of key value pairs real world dictionaries are a good analogy to understand them they contain a list of items word each item has a key the word and a value the word meaning it generally is used when we have a huge amount of data it is defined within the brace which it item being in the form of key we are creating a my dictionary so is equal to in front of it opening and closing brace key one separated by colon value one key two separated by colon value two comma key three separated by colon value three this will create a my dictionary when we print my dictionary on the user screen you can see it is starting with opening brace closing with closing brace and respective key value pairs now to create an empty dictionary we can create an empty dictionary by opening and closing brace so d1 is equal to opening and closing brace this will create an empty dictionary d1 if we check the type of d1 it is of type dict which is a dictionary another syntax of creating a empty dictionary is to call the constructor dict in front of it give opening and closing parenthesis this will also create a empty dictionary d2 if we check the type of d2 it is of type dict dict and it is a empty dictionary now we are creating a dictionary with the two key value pairs so d3 is equal to in front of it opening and closing parenthesis key is a string ram colon value is 40 key is a string sham colon value 30 this will create a dictionary d3 we will print the value of d3 on the user screen so ram 40 and sham 30 will be pre printed on the user screen if you want to assess the element of a dictionary you have to give the dictionary name in front of it opening and closing square bracket and the key for which the value is to be assessed so we want ram's age so we will write d3 in front of it opening and closing square bracket the key ram it will display the value for t changing the values associated with the dictionary if you want ram's age is not 40 it is 20 and it is to be updated then we will give the dictionary name in front of it in opening and closing square bracket we will give the key ram and we will assign the new value which is 20 so 20 will be assigned to the key ram and if we print the dictionary now d3 you can see ram's value was updated from 40 to 20 and sham's value remains as it is now we want to add a new key value pair that is a element to a dictionary syntax is dictionary name in front of the in front of it in opening and closing bracket give the new key in this case rohit and the new value 25 so we are adding a key value pair rohit and 25 to the dictionary d3 click on the cell and run the cell this key value pair is added to the dictionary if we print the dictionary on the user screen you can see it contains three elements ram 20 sham 30 and new key value pair added which is rohit 25 now you okay i'm deleting this cell escape dd click on the cell press escape dd so we delete the cell iterating over a dictionary so what i want i want to assess the key value pairs of the dictionary and i want to print it on the user screen for this i will use loop so for k is the first variable which will store the key v is the second variable which will store the value in d3 dot items this d3 dot item will access the key value pair and store it in k and v iteratively till the end of the dictionary so and inside this we will give a tab so this print statement is inside this for loop print in opening and closing parenthesis we are printing a string key and the value of key 
a string value and the value of the variable v. So what you can see, one by one key value pairs were accessed and printed on the user screen, Ran 20, Sham 30, and Rohit 25. The keys in a dictionary must always be unique and immutable. This is the reason dictionary key can be string but not list. On the other hand, values in the dictionary can be of any data type and can be duplicated. Dictionary keys are case sensitive. Same name but different case of key will be treated, as, treated distinctly means those are distinct keys. One more example of a dictionary. We are creating dictionary with the name my underscore dict. It contains three key value pair. One colon blue, two colon yellow, three colon red, where keys are integers and values are string. And then we are uh, printing my dict on the user screen. Respective key values pairs are printed on the user screen. 